Hey guys, today we're going to talk about two new products we're super excited to launch in conjunction with the guys from Unity Tactical. And that would be the Unity Tactical Clutch Belt, and then we also have a brand new product that nobody's seen yet called the Runner's Clutch Belt. Both of these in conjunction with Unity. Alright, so first of all, if you're not familiar with the Unity Clutch Belt, we're going to be doing this in three sizes and two colorways. Three sizes are small, medium, and large, and then the two colorways are it's black and ash gray, which you can see here on the table. Several different ways you can use this. Uh, first of all, this can be kitted out uh, with all your kit and gear, roll it up, throw it into a bag, throw it underneath the seat of your car, basically get your bailout kit ready to go as you need it. And you can wear it several different ways. So first it can be worn up high like a cummerbund. So I can put the Velcro around here, lock that down. And then there's a cinch, you can see here the shock cord, I can cinch that down the back according to my size. So I can wear it up high. I can wear it down more like around the waist level or uh, my shirt over it to cover it up and conceal it. And then the third location would even be down lower where I maybe have some sweatpants or tucked into my pants to help conceal and cover that up. Okay? So each of these belts comes with Velcro patches. There are stickers on the back side, I just peel these off, there's a hook on here. And literally, I can just apply that to whatever my favorite pouches are. So uh, whether it's a mag pouch, you know, double pistol mag, whatever they are, I can just uh, apply that onto the with a sticker, shove this inside the pocket I want to carry it in, and Velcro it into place. There's already loop-sided Velcro inside of each of these pockets. And then two pockets on the uh, clutch belt are actually open at the bottom. So if you have a holster that's a little bit longer, I can undo that Velcro, and then the um, barrel can stick past and through if I need to have that extra room. Okay. On the body side, we have these little uh, Hypalon panels, which do a couple of things. One, I can use these to run keepers through here, so if I want to attach it to an inner belt, I have that option. Or I can molly something on here, maybe it's a sock pee belt or whatever else I want to attach. I have that option to, uh, to run those through there to keep it in place. Okay? So that is the, uh, the clutch belt from Unity Tactical. Then we also have the runner's clutch belt. Now, each of these cells is uh, intentionally designed based upon size to carry certain products. So in this one, we size this up in the middle to have like a cat teed tourniquet, uh, so it at least fit that if you need to. And then I can have medical, first aid, extra pistol mag, extra pouches, a cell phone, whatever I want to have carried on this. The uh, intent behind this was that it was a little bit leaner or uh, lower profile than the full size uh, clutch belt. So I do want to wear this down below or tucked in. I have that option uh, behind, my, behind my waistband of my pants. Okay? The lattice work that you see here in the hypalon material is actually intentionally designed to allow different uh, things to, for example, like a you know, sock pee mini dagger or sock pee dagger to run along the crease, the natural crease here. So when you sit, it doesn't get in the, uh, in the fold there or bind up. And then it also allows you to, we can actually take two of these uh, clutch belts, uh, undo the hook and run it through the top. So I could have one in the front and I could also have one in the back uh, for, my, for my loadout in essence for low vis situations. This is going to be a one size fits all. It's adjustable waistband on here. And again, there are the keeper uh, laser cut pieces on the back side so I can attach whatever I need to uh, on, the on the body side of as well on these. 